night live. Ready to spit. Tag what evidence? Wait to take off the planet. Wow, the planet. What's up, everyone? Um, because it's too windy really to do anything too much to the car, and I was going to detail the engine, clean it up, um, but it's just way too cold. I didn't bring a jacket. Oh. So I'm just doing something in the garage. Um, so I just went out and bought a battery for my battery jumper. So I bought this about so like almost four years ago, like when I first got that. Uh, when I first got the Civic over to another house, I bought that for just a backup. And I had it, used it maybe only three times, and then the battery died. And I bought this from Walmart. I think it was paid like a little over a hundred bucks for it. I mean, it's nice. It has the air compressor, jumper of course, outlet to plug in, uh, like the cigarette outlets. And USB port charge phone has a light on top, but the battery in dead. So, took out the battery, got a new battery from Battery Plus and Bulbs in Stockton, right off the of Hammer Lane. In, yeah, Stockton. Um, cover part. So, I had them check the battery, and it said that it only had like two, two volts, and it's not holding its charge. So, I got a new one, Duracell Ultra. So I'm gonna put it in, hopefully it was just a battery issue. I'm gonna put it in, see what happens. Hopefully it powers, cause I wanna get some air into these tires and jump start it. And then I'm gonna drive it up and down the street just to kinda, I guess you could say, clean off the rotors. Cause the rotors are drilled slot in the front and slot in the rear. And if I can clean the rust or whatever is built up on there, just to do that for now because I'm pretty sure you can't resurface those so and I really don't want to buy a whole new set because I only had those tires the Inky 92 tires tires wheels and rotors and brakes for less than six months before I fell asleep and hit the wall on the freeway so everything's still new so hopefully it's still good but I'm gonna put on this put in the battery and Hopefully it lights up and works, so. Say I'm tired. <laughs> so we'll be right back. figure it out. So I'm going to pop these sides here. So the battery's in, everything's connected. Right, we'll get power for the air. Um, so I'm just going to figure this out. This pops back in. So I'm going to push the battery back in. Let me uh, fiddle with this and then I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> well, it turns out there's three slots right here and three on the bottom. Pull down the rubber piece here and it slides right in. <laughs> and I'll just gotta screw it in and I'm done. And then we'll. Put some of these tires. So let me screw this in real quick and get this going. All right, so I got it all in now. Um, showing 100%. So that's good. Lights work. So 
have 12.7 volts on it. And let's push it here. And I guess this part right here is for like if you have a air mattress or something blow up. And I don't know what I do with the accessories, so that's gone. But at least I can pump up the tires on the car. So works good. So I'm gonna air up the tires and then hopefully I can jump that dead battery. If not then I know I'm gonna have to go buy another battery. Is what it is. So let's go set it up and put some around these tires. So I can drive this up and down the street real quick. Alright. Now I was gonna do a time lapse on it airing up the tires but that's gonna take a while, so no. So let's take a look at the car again, I guess. So, once again, Lincoln had two wheels. Um, I found those at Tire Rack for 137 for one rent. Uh, 15 by seven. These are 15 by sevens. So at least now I can get one wheel pop it on there and then I'll drive that back to the house and put it in the garage but I gotta make room in the garage for the Yukon and that and there's the no limit tank this is my daily driver so yeah it's a chill but gets me where I need to go so gotta get this going um, I spoke to a guy named Hi um, he has his own business uh, detailing business uh, I'll put the description in there if you guys want to check him out on Instagram. Uh, work is very clean. He does really good waxing and interior cleaning, shampooing, and so I think I'm going to go with him. So I'm gonna, before I drive this off, I'm going to have him come out here, detail the inside and out of the car, and then I'm going to drive it out. So that'll be one thing. Let me check my tire before I put too much air. Well, the that wheel had air in it. It's just sunk into the dirt. So I think I checked that because I didn't want to pop that tire if it's way too much. Um, let me check. Yeah, this one needs air. The one in the back is sunk into the dirt, so I'm gonna put air in this one and then see if I can start this up. So. Just give me a second and I'll be right back. What's up everyone? Um, power open, pop the hood. That's my dad. And we're gonna put the battery inside the engine and get this started. And I'm gonna drive up and down the street and clean out the brakes, uh, brake rotors. So I'll set it up right here. Very windy, so it just doesn't fall. And I apologize for the the angling of this camera. I bought a whole bunch of new accessories for it, so hopefully it's not. Yeah, so here we go. Battery's connected, got the steering wheel, we'll jump on in. And I need to be careful because I do not have seatbelts in here. And the bottom piece is in the butt. The one key. I do not have any other copies of this. Okay. 
and then go hook up the the jump box and let it sit on there and see if I can get this thing started. All right, plug it in. On. Let's see what happens. Positive, negative. Oh, well, power's on. So, let's see if I'll start. Starts right up. I love it. One thing I always wondered if I have any CDs in here. running I'm gonna go ahead and uh, disconnect it drive the car around and then it's gonna work so, hold on I'm gonna tell you mount you guys in the back of this so, give me a second all right guys um, wheels are kind of buried so I gotta try to get out of these little sucking poles but the car is running
this is the basic uh, pin springs, uh, Eagle Blue sh the shock. swap this mirror in because the other one fell out so honestly I never used it I just bought it and kept it so I gotta get kind of used to driving with this mirror running great. Uh, those D series are very strong and that's the aftermath of five years of what's growing underneath and I need this piece for the battery. So my dad. <laughs> so the car is running great, sounds great, feels great. Um, I'm gonna eventually drive this. I know I gotta clean it up a little bit so I can see out those wi uh, windows and clean the mirrors as well but I mean it doesn't sit low. I mean I have good wheel gap but I like function so once I go 16s for when I go to the track it'll go up a little bit but these are just like I said these are my winter wheels. I love them and the car is running good, idling good. So, feels nice. Still looks clean, and so I mean, drivable. I just gotta clean it up and have it detailed. Uh, tiny little buffer. Uh, stop. It's runs really nice. I enjoy it. Back door open. stickers so I gotta take the inspired off Filipino star and then I'm gonna keep the whole boss stickers on there still I mean still good looking so I'll take care of that do that and then set to go so they park this back in there super windy and it's cold so uh might do that either tomorrow so but there it is running great love this car I, yes. you know one thing i didn't check on this car is if the hids work fog lights work or rear fog lights or even my tail lights work so i'm gonna throw on my hazards and turn on the headlight and see how that works. So, throw on the hazards, turn on the headlights, fog lights, and let's see if they work. Let's check out the rear first. Lights light up. Fog light is not turning on. Let's check out the front. So I do have blinkers. I have running lights, but I do not I have only one HID working, and my fog lights are not turning on, so let me see if it's a switch, check that out. Because I know they were working before, so, yeah, they're both out, 
and the back fog light is not working either. So, gonna have to replace those. So, at least uh, I know what needs to be done electrically wise. But other than that, the car one's great. So, I'll turn that off. And, there you go. Alright, y'all. Thanks for watching. Peace. Wake up in the morning, money on my mind Looking at my rolling eyes yeah, about that time I get up and grind, I get up and grind I get up and grind, I get up and grind, yeah, I get up and grind. <laughs> Resort